Hey, all right, Sears. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Reading Journey. I'm Journey. And we are having a little fun. We're doing a full moon reading for this full moon is for Sagittarius. Um, you're picking the pile that you're most drawn to, the energy that you're most drawn to, and that is going to be your read for the energy in the full moon of Sagittarius. Full moons are about releasing, but also I've often seen with full moons, with releasing, new beginnings also start as well. And I also hope that you're finding your favorite astrologist to see uh, what re who resonates with you because they can give you a lot of information as well. So let's get into it. So we're going to go ahead and start with pile one. Let's see what the energies are for this first pile. All right. Ooh, third eye activation. Okay. Something is going to be coming very clear to you, Pile One. And music is a very is very prominent for you at this time. And I feel like you're going to find your answers through music. By listening to music, music brings um, I'm hearing vibration. So they're also saying like 432 hertz. Um, music is all around us. Sound is showing me like a lake things like that. So getting to a lake, uh, listening to music, listening to even lakes on YouTube or sounds like that. Sound is going to be very prominent for you, helping to bring things to uh, fruition is what I'm getting. Let's see. So some type of plan is coming to fruition for you. Something is balanced out. The two of coins, so yeah, something is balanced out. This is reverse as well. So you're going to be able to balance out something at this time, something that you maybe been having some challenges. Maybe you haven't been able to sleep or maybe you've just been really, really busy. Maybe that I'm hearing clearly the ADHD has been on like <laughs> hyper, like extra, extra hyper or something. I don't know if I'm making any sense, but... Basically, what I'm getting is you're going to be able to balance something out. Yeah, because I feel like you've had to be many people in the last maybe week or few weeks. And maybe you just haven't felt at unrest. All these masks. Yeah, you've had to maybe you've been giving, giving, giving a lot. 2.33 on the clock. So that's coming to an end. You've mastered something. That phase, that cycle is over for you. And so a new commitment comes through. Okay, a new wish. Or you've been working on something that's going to bring you a wish. All right. Whatever you've been working on is bringing you some type of success with this new moon. You may not see it right away, 2.55 on the clock, but it's coming. You will see it. And it's not going to take very too long. Like you're going to, it's going to surprise you if you've been working on something. Okay. Um, somebody also could be wanting to. This is for like one person. Somebody may want to commit with you at this time. They might finally uh, admit that, hey, I'm ready for this commitment. Let's go forward. Someone may be finding out that they're pregnant. I'm hearing that as well. Or you're going to be announcing to somebody that you are pregnant. There could also be a baby shower happening um, during this weekend as well. But definitely, look, I do see some type of release of a commitment. Somebody wants to commit to you or you to them or you to something okay so there's a commitment to something um and that's beautiful beautiful but i do see balance out for you as well i see something being able to finally slow down um you're going to be able to have a there's light at the tunnel now okay and I, what i'm getting is like but you may not still feel like, where is this all headed? You know something good is taking place. Something good is happening. You see the beginning of the release, but you don't see the full, full release just yet. You will see it in the coming days or weeks, okay? But this is really beautiful. This is good. All right, let's move on to pal two. Yeah, I just feel like throwing up. Something is definitely releasing from you. All right, pile two. All right, some type of secret is revealed, pile two. Hmm. You may be also committing to something. There may be an initiation of something. There could be a good, a new contract and the ethers coming through for you as well. 
new relationship for somebody. This could be a relationship in love. This could be a relationship in career. But there's some type of new initiation, commitment. Someone also may find out somebody has been doing something that maybe they've been living a lie in a situation that has just been a fairy tale. Hmm. Something that was a happy, happy ever after is now something that you're going to have to walk away from. But you've learned from this experience, okay? I feel like you, some of you already know about this. Some of you may be finding out. Some, many of you are going to quickly realize, though, it's a learning experience. I do feel like somebody was like, you know what? I knew this, though. I shouldn't have set myself up for this. I'm getting that as well. Somebody already had a chess move, though. Looks to me like somebody already had a backup plan. It's only at 55. Wow. So somebody was like, that's fine. Because I already knew that this could happen, whatever this is, whether it's love, whether it's career, whether it's family, whatever it is. But you have a backup plan. So somebody that you could be dealing with, um, yeah, somebody you're dealing with ended up, uh, I'm also hearing flaking out on something. You could be finding out somebody's in a, in a commitment, but you kind of knew somebody like in the back of their mind, like I kind of knew like this person wasn't done or they were with somebody. I feel like somebody did try to advise you or warn you about this person, but you were like, I, you know, I'm going to see it on my, on my own, but you already have some type of strategic plan. So some strategic plan is already, I kind of, I feel like somebody is like, well, you, well, you know what? If this happens, I'm just going to go do this. Somebody kind of knew this was already going to happen. That this person was hiding or somebody was hiding something from you or this job or whatever. But I feel like in a sense too, they did you a favor. You may not see it now, but you might see it later is what I'm getting. I do hear I should have listened. But it's funny too, because I hear somebody going like, man, I knew you was going to do that anyway. I didn't even care because I was already over here with this person. I was already going to do this. So that's what I'm getting. I'm getting like somebody already knew. Like, whatever. Like somebody's just not even really too much phased by this. This isn't like... It's almost like an energy of like this person was like, I, I was just waiting for it to come out. It could even be a job. Like, I knew this job was about to close. I was just waiting for them to say something. Something like that. It's like you knew something in your heart was going to take place. Some type of secret was revealed. Something was being hidden from you. And it was true. You're like, I already knew. And I already had a back. So you may even have, like, if it's a job, you already had another job. Or you already looking for other jobs. Or you had already taken another job. You know what I mean? Something like that. Hmm. Good for you. All right, let's go ahead and move on to three. Pile three. Pile three. Holy grail, baby. All right. Let's see. You discover something about yourself during this full moon. I had a feeling this card was going to come out. You're discovered, somebody's going to do something that's going to make them money, but it's something that you enjoy. This is not something that popped out the sky. This is something for somebody who put in work and they trusted the divine and whatever the divine, this idea the divine gave them is really going to make this person successful. They're going to do very, very well, very well. It's just meant to be. This was given by the divine. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Whatever you chose to do, you aimed it in the right position. Okay. This is truly your gift. Whatever you're creating or doing, whatever you've done, it's going to bring you finances. This is from the divine. This idea and somebody rolled with it. Somebody trusted their intuition and just started doing what they love. Try not to work too hard though. Because I feel like there's somebody though. Might be worried like I don't know. I'm working really hard. Is this going to take off? 
You're doing it though anyway. You're doing it and you might be, but what I'm getting like, you're doing a little too much. Slow down. It's going to do well. I might be too late saying this and the full moon is helping you to do that because you've put all the work in. So I feel like the divine is giving you the strength to go forward, but make sure you're taking rests and breaks. Yeah, because this is, this is going to bring you the nine of coins here. I'm seeing this card two ways. One, you are enough. You don't have to do all of this. I'm telling you, the divine is backing you with whatever this idea or side hustle that you're doing. Won't, it, I'm hearing clearly, it won't be a side hustle for long for somebody. If, this, if you didn't start a side hustle, you need to start this. The divine has got something that you're good at that you need to start. I'm hearing put your voice to. I don't know. Maybe you're doing voiceovers. I don't know. You want to do voices. I don't know. There's something about your voice, your throat chakra, because whatever you're doing, it's bringing money for you. This is your calling. This is your calling. You may be seeing a lot of birds. Yeah, there's something coming through. There's even a message coming through for somebody also this weekend. There's a message coming through for someone that's going to release you financially from financial problems. This, I'm hearing, it's going to shock you. It's going to shock you. Let me see if I can get more on that. That just came. It just hit me at the last minute. Check out and turn up the right way. What is this that's going to shock them? What is this? What's this shocker? Two of swords. Something that's going to bring you peace. You don't see this coming. You do not see this coming. Let me see if I can. You might, it might come from, a message might come from a masculine, a lawyer, or I don't know who this is, y'all. This is not everybody, okay? Because this is only for the weekend. The Holy Spirit, we can keep it to that. But something's coming through to bring you peace. It's going to shock you. You do not see this coming. Yeah. Some type of support comes through. You did not see this. That's again, bringing you to these two swords, some type of communication that's going to surprise you. You did not see this coming. You may have gotten a dream about it or a download. What is this? 66. Some of you, this could be somebody... Someone has someone trying to commit to them and it took them a lot to do this, to push forward. Somebody, yeah, somebody that could be from your past, somebody that you've had sexual relationships before with in the past. Sixty-six here. So you may want to check out sixty-six. This might be this is a surprise message from someone or call. There's some type of surprise here. But the main thing I'm getting for all, for the rest of you is whatever you're putting your mind to, what you're trying to do, is going to bring you prosperity. It's going to bring you some type of luck. It's going to, listen, it's going to, yeah, that's exactly where I was going. It's going to bring you abundance. If you haven't started this, you need to start this. Abundance, prosperity. Damn near overnight is what I'm getting. You're going to be shocked. But this Holy Grail, because it's what you're supposed to be doing. So if you haven't started it, I was started on this full moon. I was for sure started. Because somebody, you're thinking, okay, this will probably, you know, maybe it'll do good, maybe it won't. But somebody's been praying over this. And like in a matter of somebody days, even weeks, months. Somebody's going to be able to just leave. If you're at a job, I see four, four, four and o'clock. If you're at a full-time job, you're going to be able to leave. You're going to be able to quit. <laughs> you're going to be able to quit. I don't know how I'm going to say that. But you're going to be able to quit. This is a new beginning for you. 
it's going to bring you success. All right. So I hope you found it helpful. Thank y'all so much. I appreciate you. And I hope that gives you some insight over the weekend. This uh, full moon Sagittarius weekend. Jupiter is about expansion, peace, love, and harmony. Namaste.